Chuck Hitsek from Home Quarters and today's episode of Blockbuster, we are featuring dairy farm residents. So stay tuned to the very end where we check out how living in a residence just above food hall, childcare, supermarket, retail and F&B outlet is like here in dairy farm residences. So without further ado, let's check it out. Before you head into the show gallery proper, do remember YouTube subscriber, do subscribe, like, comment and also ring the notification icon for more videos such as this. If you're on Facebook and Instagram, do follow and like us at Homequarters SG. So without further ado, welcome to Dairy Farm Residences. Alright, imagine yourself coming back home from work and before heading up to your residence, you can come into the supermarket that is just right downstairs. The convenience, the time saving that you can have when everything is just right downstairs. Once you're done with your grocery shopping, you can go ahead to pamper yourself in the retail, the F&B outlet, food store, specialty food store that is just right downstairs as well before heading to the childcare centre to pick up your kid before heading back up. Back home. So this is the kind of life that you can lead here at Dairy Farm Residences. So where exactly is Dairy Farm Residence? District 23 between Petir and also Dairy Farm Road developed by United Engineer the Limited. We have a total of 460 units in total, four blocks. Two blocks of five storey each and also two blocks of 15 storey each. Almost 50-50 between two beta and also 50% three bedroom and also four bedroom. One most interesting thing here is that around here, we are surrounded by nature and also just right downstairs because the mixed development with commercial component in here, we have shops, restaurant, food hall, childcare center, or just right downstairs in the basement one and first floor level that is separated kind of from the residential units. Standing at a side area of close 211,000 square feet, you have a lot of space to play with and also this area, this residence comes with one-to-one -one parking space. As you come into a development, this is the main entrance drop-off area. So if you let's say you are healing for caps, you can actually stay here whether it's rain or shine, you'll be protected over on this side. As you come into the development itself, you can see a beautiful, beautiful lab pool that greets you as you come in straight at the grand entrance itself. Most of the development here, the blocks are north-south facing and of course on the shorter block, you can actually overlook the entire length of the lab pool on this side. Moving along, we got on the left side here, we have a great facility uh, peppered along the entire development such as your outdoor fitness center, your outdoor grill area so that the entire place is so huge you will not be congesting with all other residents or tenants that is located in this development itself. I also do like that they have a variance of short block and also tall block so that it will not be uniform all throughout. That is quite rather boring. Coming over on this front along Petir Road, we have all your food store, retail store that is just right downstairs on the basement one level and also level one. Coming over on this side, you can see that we have most of the facility that is situated just right in here. And of course, for public access, we have a bus stop along Pertier Road itself. So if you are coming in by the public transport, you can see that there's a green kind of mall entrance. It's essentially, the different residence is kind of like a village on itself. It's really self-suffice. You have childcare, restaurant, food hall, retail, and the likes. Over on the top, second floor and third floor level, we have your main facility deck level. I do like that they separate out the lab pool area and also kind of the leisure pool area. So if let's say you are into serious sports and you want to train, you can do it at the lab pool area. And if you want to do kind of barbecue lifestyle, wading, kind of chilling out, you can actually do so on this front. You can see that there's a hilltop bar, there is a hilltop dining area. So you can enjoy the entire nature view that is surrounding the dairy farm area while you dine out or even chill out, hang out with your friends, family and guests that is coming over to your condominium. Coming over on this side, there is other facility that is peppered all around the main facility deck level like a BBQ, your Miss Garden. If you like to do an early morning stroll or late night stroll to just clear up your head, you can do so right inside the development and you don't even need to go out even though you're surrounded by nature here in the dairy farm vicinity. I do also like that there is a kind of like a sky gymnasium while you're doing your cardio, sweating it out, you can enjoy the beautiful nature that Dairy Farm facility have to offer. So on this front, we have a full-size tennis court, which is rather rare now with newer development because space is really, really limited here in Singapore. And over on this front, you can see that just right at the corner of the residential unit, we have a dedicated play area for kids. Great for socializing if let's say you're building up your family 
in here. Also on the back side, you can see that there is a grand drop-off area over for the retail and the mall side and the restaurant side that is just behind that bus stop area. So you can also see that there is a separate entrance into the mall as opposed to combining the parking lot area and also sharing the lane towards the shopping space. So this will actually resolve the entire congestion that some integrated or even mixed-use development have experienced. So I think this architect is actually meticulous in doing up this sort of layout. This is our architecture here in Dairy Farm Residences. That concludes one round around the show model. I hope this gives you insights into Dairy Farm Residential show model and also the site plan. Talking about amenities around Dairy Farm Residences, we're going to talk about transport system. We have a free shuttle bus on the first year towards Bukit Panjang MRT Station and also Hillview MRT Station. But if you say you are walking, it's just nine minutes away from MRT station, Hillview MRT stop. That means that you probably wouldn't sweat even if you are in a jacket and trousers. If you are driving, we can take the BKE towards PIE and also KJE. That means that you are just 20 minutes away from the City Hall MRT station if you are driving to work. Buying here, of course, you're going to enjoy the nature that this place have to offer. The nearest, of course, is Dairy Farm Nature Reserve. Coming down, we've got Bukit Timah Nature Reserve. You can enjoy some hiking on the trails or over on the upslope there. And also on the Bukit Timah Hill itself. If you are into period drama, you want to definitely go and visit Little Kui Ling. We call it in Chinese, Xiao Kui Ling, where you look as if you're not in Singapore anymore and probably in some remote Chinese kind of village with the mountain ranges. For the primary school going children within one camp away from Dairy Farm Residences, we have CHIJ Our Lady, Queen of Peace and also Bukit Panjang Primary School. Within 2KM, we have Chenghua Primary School as well. Also, we are minutes drive away from the Bukit Dima Education Belt where we have tertiary education and international school all peppered along this education belt itself. Alright, so now we are done with the school. Let's talk about the entertainment and lifestyle side of things. Let's say, if the shop downstairs is not enough, you can stay northwards towards the Bukit Panjang region where you enjoy new malls such as Hillel Mall or even right down south to Beauty World where you can enjoy Bukit Tima Shopping Centre. Now let's talk about the developer, United Engineer. They have been involved in a lot of iconic development here in Singapore that includes our Supreme Court and also the famous commercial building OCBC Centre. Talking about residential, do they have all this experience? They do have prominent and proven track record in the residential space that include a river suite in the Wampo region and also the Rochester along Rochester Drive area. So I think Dairy Farm residents, buyer, you are in safe hands here because of all this proven track record by the developer. What's more interesting is that if you really want a fast free move-in experience and really want a turnkey unit, you can actually just add on some specific amount and have your entire unit fully fitted out before you collect your keys. One smart feature that I do like for the development is that it does allow you to grant visitor access through your phone for delivery men even and also a guest that is coming into your unit. Before you head into the show unit, so if you are keen on Dairy Farm Residences or any other new launch condominium development here in Singapore, do give us a call at 8809 2889. My name is Casey from Home Quarters. Welcome to the 2-way 2 bath here in Dairy Farm Residences, 710 square feet. As you come in here, one notable thing is that your switches are all outside, so you don't need to open your cupboard to access to all this switch. I also do like that it has a full-size oven right in here. On the right side itself, just like what the developer has done, you can copy what their interior design has been doing, is that you have additional shelving, additional storage space in here because in this 2 bed 2 bath unit, we do not have an extra storage space. Coming over on this side, another distinct feature is that we have a much longer kind of a dining space in here. What the developer has put in is a four-seater but definitely a round table or even a six-seater is possible to put in here as well. So that's it for all the distinguished factors here in the two bed two bath here in Dairy Farm Residences and let us show you to the rest of the units. Welcome to the 3 bath here, 936 square feet. As you come in here, the first thing you'll see is this kitchen area. Closed kitchen concept meaning that you have a gas stove, 
and also ventilation they can fully close up if you are doing some work hey stir frying inside here i do like that you have a large countertop space area for you to do your food preparation and also a lot of storage on the top and bottom cabinet space coming back out into the unit itself if you come in here you got a good size dining area and i do like that you have a huge living space area so that means that you can do a huge panel of kind of a big sofa area chill area and have your projection screen throw a huge a projection out onto the wall itself or even if you want to put in your LED screen LCD TV you could do so on kind of like an 80 inch kind of concept in here as well alternatively you can do what the developer has done put in a feature wall for more storage if you do need that coming over on this side because it's 936 square feet this is very efficiently laid out that the balcony is not too big just a good enough balcony space for you to put your chair your table great for an afternoon relaxation reading tea and also snack in this balcony space. So that's it for the balcony space. Let's head back to the unit. Let's look at the living quarters of this unit. Here we have the first common bedroom, full length window, good enough space for you to put in a queen size bed, of course wardrobe, floor and also AC has been provided for you. Those two common bedrooms share this common bathroom here and then they spare no expense even though it's a common bathroom they still give you a wall hung wc that means that it's easier for you to clean up and also fully vented with a big window over on that side that prevent mildew and more hot plumbing after a hot steamy shower coming over on this space i do like that we have over on this common bedroom a beautiful l-shaped kind of window in here a good enough oblong longish rectangular space so that you can put in a bunk bed or even having a queen size bed in here to bedside table enjoying the nature view as you wake up from a long night of sleep your wardrobe flooring and ac as well already provided for you so that's it for the two common bedroom and i am excited to show you this master bedroom space go come on with me all right i'm excited to show you this master bedroom space as you head inside you can see that it's, it's a huge space because we just passed by the master bathroom we're going to check out later on you got a good size king size bed bedside table and i do like that it's a full length window here and just behind you we have a big wall space for you to put in your projection screen your feature wall for the developer they're putting a huge mirror space as well water has been done up for you Floor has been done up for you ac of course has been done up for you as well all right follow me over on this side you can see that the wardrobe is kind of special in this master bedroom where you have additional kind of tie closet knickknacks that you can put in here and also it comes with a full length mirror here as well so just beside we have the master bathroom space no expense has been spared rain shower wohang wc quality quartz countertop and of course not forgetting very importantly we have a good big window over on this front that's it for the three bedroom here at dairy farm residence let's move on to check out the four bedroom all right before we head into the four bedroom layout in here just to note is that dairy farm residence four bedroom has completely been sold out so to avoid disappointment like this unit here at dairy farm residence do contact us quick my name is casey from home quarters all right so welcome to the four bedroom space 1324 square feet as you come in you have a good space area for you to put in additional cabinet additional space for you to wear your shoe before you head out to face the world coming into this front we have a dry kitchen over here and also a wet kitchen over here i do like this glass panel for you to interact with your guests friends or family when you come over here we have a fully functional kitchen of course we've got a sink we have the dishwasher we have the convection oven microwave and on this side hood hop gas stove very important for chinese asian cooking stir frying deep frying you want it here as well we've got a ventilation window on this side that's very important of course kitchen area it leads to a proper yard area that put in your washer and dryer and a proper area for you to do your laundry and also we have your wc right behind if let's say you're a staying helper you can also try to allow them to stay inside the yard area through probably a bunk bed concept on this space so that's it for the kitchen yard area and wc let's head back out to the living and dining space coming into the living and dining room space as you guys know me i do love myself a landscape layout living and dining room space living can be in here your dining can be in here and alternatively you can move your dining entirely coming out into the balcony area having a larger living area or even putting in a study corner on this front for the kids or if let's say you are working from home you can do it here as well i also do like that the entire balcony is sort of like an extension of your living and dining area throughout to the outdoor area 
and in dairy farm residence of course it will be helpful to have a balcony space because sitting in the balcony space area you're going to enjoy the beautiful view that the entire dairy farm region have to offer for you and alternatively if you do not like that throw in a zip track decked out the entire space you can be an extension actually of the entire living and dining area coming back into the space area we can see that on this side itself we have all your rooms and we have three bedrooms on this front this three common bedroom is served by this common bathroom here and no expense has been spared we have your warhang wc a great window over on this side and also a quality quartz top countertop as well all the sanitary fitting is by grow here and also the sink by Belroy's and botch coming over on this front i am excited to show you the master bedroom space because it's so huge and you have your own balcony to boot you can do your yoga in here you can enjoy your wine chill down in the evening you got a good size bedroom space king size bedside table is no problem in here i also do like that you have a walk-in wardrobe kind of concept in here and you are able to put in a full size dressing area on this front beautiful master bathroom space wong wc quartz countertop and not forgetting that rain shower that you do desire to wash out all your stress after a long day of work and also we have your ventilation there is a huge window space in here so who do we think are the perfect buyers for dairy farm residents if you do love to want to stay in a place where nature is surrounding you and also the convenience of having shops childcare soul market just right at your doorstep dairy farm residents is definitely one that you can shortly so if you are keen for our opinion and to want to visit dairy farm residences do give us a call at 809 my name is Casey Home Quarters and till then remember call home quarters and start packing your public transport out oh, <laughs> a gas stove and also ventilation on work onto this master bedroom space as you come yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yes.